it's another foggy one this morning uh, 70 degrees nice and warm it's currently 8 15 and we're heading to walmart walmart so yeah slight change of plan we've decided not to do animal kingdom today uh we're just not up to the crowds so we're going to do a slightly different day we're going to Walmart and then we're going to head to Disney Springs for some shopping because you can't beat shopping. Oh no. And the best time to do Disney Springs is always when it opens. Um, the crowds are always worse in the evening when people are coming out of the parks and stuff. So yeah, we're going to head. It's only about 10 minutes from our villa to Walmart. It's a nice new one that's been built. Yeah. But it's not really that new now. It's like a year old now. <laughs> but it's still new to us. And then Disney Springs, I think we're going to try and grab lunch down there. I think there might be a chicken guy. Oh. Oh yes, what do you mention chicken guys Luke? Or a blaze pizza <laughs> and for a blaze me. Pizza. <laughs> uh, so we'll be eating at two different places. <laughs> but the um then this evening we're heading to we're heading to the contemporary resort for California Grill. Yeah we have so in Walt Disney World they do the New Year's Eve fireworks on the 30th and the 31st and it normally applies definitely applies at Magic Kingdom and it normally applies at Epcot as well so tonight we're actually going to go see the New Year's fireworks from the California Grill at midnight so it's a late one so we're going to be spending some time napping today catching up on sleep a bit of Disney today in the morning um, and then yeah just so yeah bit of a chill day because tomorrow is going to be a lot more busier. Yeah, and then look at this, it's so foggy. And it's just the sun obviously this time of year, it's just not hot enough to burn this off straight away. So it will be nice later and it's due to be 84 today. So it's going to be hot. 84 degrees. A couple hundred miles away Denying that something has changed We've arrived at Walmart. We're gonna get just piles and piles of barbecue sauce. <laughs> so I always put Luke in charge to get in the cart. Chief Carter. <laughs> Here we do our traditional cart update. We picked up some travel essentials. These are always so good, these toothbrush holders. 99 cents. They're really good. This was like a dollar or something, wasn't it? 97 cents? Yeah. A little plastic um, first aid kit. Little lint roller. These are all like a dollar. Pretty much. Really good center. value. Yeah. And we've got toothpaste. They haven't got our toothpaste yet. We normally get the crest, don't we? Yeah. Found it. This is the toothpaste that we like to get. It's uh, it is cheaper in the US than at home. Yeah. Uh oh. Candles. Uh -huh. <laughs> They're really good value and they smell really nice. Really good value. These like wax cubes are 93 cents each. And there's one that Amanda Mitchell have that smells like um like a passage called Hidden Springs. Hidden Springs, but it doesn't look like they have it. We've looked all along, all of these, but they have every other one apart from those. Pumpkin apple muffins, holiday cookies. So good and really good value. And we're back looking for the cat's things. Oh, who's the licking these tunes? Oh, they would like those. You can shake yeah. it there. Oh, they would go crazy for that sound. <laughs> That's shaking sound. But if you come and you're looking for cat treats to take back, they do a really good selection here, don't they? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I like that one. Can get one of them? So the Walmart have also got a clearance bit as well. 50% off. 50%! Luke spotted the Reese's, if you can reach it. One dollar. <laughs> one dollar, that's really good value. One dollar. Oreos, any new flavours, any new flavours? Oh, we have to get the red velvet one. No, the pistachio cream. Pistachio cream? Pistachio cream thin one. Ooh. And cinnamon bun. So we're getting a red velvet then? Do you pick one up? No. Red velvet. Walmart do an amazing selection of candy canes here. And they're actually good until, I think Luke was just spotting they're good till um, 2020. So if you did want to bring some back and uh, hang them up on the following year. I mean these ones, Warheads, Super Sour. And Valentine's, gone is Christmas and now Valentine's Day is in. <laughs> yeah. Snapple. So I've picked up the um, peach tea. You picked up something didn't you Luke? Yeah. You picked up a drink didn't you? I got a um, super tea. tea. Yeah. Ooh. Moon pie. What does that remind you of, Luke? Nashville. 
Oh yeah. That's so and, nice. Um, Cracker Barrel. And Cracker Barrel, yeah. Marshmallow sandwich. Yum. The moment has arrived. Oh, wow, look at the size of this one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that is crazy. That's a big one. Even do these ones though, these big sizes here. They're quite cheap as well actually. Yeah, 348. You'd be lucky to get that in pounds for the smaller I can one. See Hawaiian. Where's the Hawaiian? <gasps> Where is it? Oh, there it is. Come to me. So, car update. We've got some candy. We found these lemon head twists, which look really nice. And we've got barbecue sauce. And some chips. That is one blue Fanta. It's not coming out well on the camera, but that is really blue. So, this is the damage. <laughs> we got goodies. We got our goodies. We're just saying this is a suitcase alone <laughs> to get back. Oh, we're gonna look forward to packing. Next we trip to Walmart. We've got all the stuff we wanted. We normally do it like our last morning, where we just like go mad. But we've like done it earlier this time, just just because it's so busy, and we're going down the beach this time. So we didn't want to on our last day have to worry about that, did we? Yeah, and it was a really comfortable experience. We went down there like what eight o'clock. Yes, yeah. just so it was so quiet. And now we're on the one nine two. And the big Disney World sign. So we're headed to Disney Springs. Disney Springs. New garage parking garages. That's orange up there. So people go up along there, and that's into the orange garage. Uh, we're going to go in the left lane, ready for the lime garage. There's a little subtle hint there for me. <laughs> lime garage is, I think, most central to where we like to go. Yeah. That's whether they're still doing the same entrance, because they did block off doing a U-turn, didn't they, last time? We have to do a left turn into here, and they got stopped here. It looks like it'll be a permanent change. Yeah, that's what it's permanent. So we can do a U-turn on this next one, so we're going to do that, because lime is the best one to park in. And they've got the new one over there now, which I think is watermelon or strawberry. Watermelon, maybe? I don't know. Maybe strawberry. That's connected by a big bridge. So let's do a U turn. And Lime Garage. I love that little Disney Springs water tower. Right, are we going to be able to get on level two? Level two is what we want. I can't see the screen anymore. I swear they used to yeah, be a screen. Yeah, there used to be a screen now, I'm sure. The screens are working up here, so we're going to go on this one. So level one is the best one, because you're literally on the level where you can get a walkway across to Disney Springs. And they're actually directing into this one, actually. So. These pizza is closed for refurb. Oh, no. <laughs> it's not. <laughs> that was cruel. <laughs> but we, I think that's where you're heading for today, isn't it? We can walk, yeah, we can walk. Yeah. We've actually got a really good space. So this is going to take us out right to the, the walkway across. Yeah. You can see we've literally, what, 10 seconds away from the car, can come see? down the uh, escalator on the right way. You can't get down that way. <laughs> I think it did used to be that side, yeah. It's going to take us straight down. Craving for coffee, so we're gonna stop at Starbucks. <laughs> Let's go to Starbucks. I got a venti chai tea latte. Let's try it. Chai tea latte. I've never had a tea latte before. No. So. You could have had it hot or cold, but you went with hot. I went with hot. It's gonna be, it's gonna be um, hot or hot. So yeah. That is so nice. Yeah? Chai tea latte. Okay, thumbs up, so we could. this could be a regular. Addition to the vlogs. I need to try and buy this to take home. <laughs> yeah. So it's 20 to 10 and Ghirardelli is open. We are headed to Ghirardelli. So we were kind of hanging around, weren't we, until 10 when it officially opens according yeah. to the website. They've got the cantina thing there as well. Yeah. And Stitch is up there, look. It doesn't feel squat water, does he? 
I don't know if he still spurs. I don't think he does anything. No, because I feel like I'm stood in a very precarious, precarious position. <laughs> Okay, it's 50% off. Oh, yeah, 92. Of peppermint bark. It's 250 for half a pound. Uh, this huge bag here with caramels, originals, and peppermint. Normally 30, it's going to be 15. 15. Yeah, that's what a really good deal. Yeah. And these are cute as well, these little star. Yeah, where are they good to? Star pots, peppermint bark. Best July. It's a long time on them. So 50% off these are $8, $8.95. I'm gonna get and they're good till July. Let's get a couple of these. Yeah, we're gonna get a couple of these. These are good values. Should we do one of the. How many mini mints? That's nice. I like that tin. How much is that? $12. We've got some great deals in Ghirardelli. $70 worth of stuff for $35. Yeah, but about the free samples. They no longer give out free samples. Yeah, no more. Free, free samples or no more. Did you put on free samples in here? They're in my pocket. If you want to try a specific flavour, you can ask. So we've got some peppermint brownie to try. Yeah, they're always happy to let you try one, but in terms of the sound of free samples, they've gone. We not No. Just chilling right now, waiting for the Christmas shop to open. We want to try and hunt down the uh, alien in the teacup. The alien teacup with the penguin. I wonder who that's for. No. <laughs> I really like this chai tea latte. It's really good. We sat next to a really loud speaker, so I'm not sure how much you can hear. Yeah, there's a lizard on there as well. The hunt begins. Oh, look. Oh, look. There's one chip. Mostly Dales. Mostly Dales. Where's the one chip? Oh, there he is. That's what So good. These are nutcrackers, and Amanda Mitchell got us uh, Dale. So we are missing chip. Maybe next time. Oh, hello there. Happy Merry Joy. Seven Dwarfs, they're such a beautiful store. This is a beautiful store. It's so quiet in here right now. So we're still on the hunt for the alien decoration. Will we see it? I just found it. Oh, look at it, look at that. We've been, been looking for spinners as well, look at that. We've been looking for this. Right, so long. let's pick, pick which one you want and let's get it. How much is it? Uh, it is. Not that it matters, but. Uh, 21.99. Which is so cute as well. So many decorations. A lovely one. And also this amazing stocking. Chippendale. In a teacup. In a spinning teacup. Got to get it. So nice. Pin time. Pin time. Nice bruised ones here as well. Yeah, so I've already spotted this castaway key one, the very last. I think we've got that one. I thought I recognised it. I'm gonna get Vera Beach. Little castaway key with Mickey there. You can see I'm steering towards a cruise line pin. So. I'll get the Vera Beach one. Yeah, Lou's gonna pick up this really nice Vera Beach one. And the boardwalk. I like that boardwalk one. Yeah, I think we've got It's been a while since we've been in Trendy, so we're gonna have a little nose, aren't we? Yeah, some of them. Bubblegum all ears, look. Bubblegum all ears. If there were any all ears we'd get, these would probably be the ones. Yeah. Especially Perth on the ears. <laughs> oh, just imagine Willow in this. <laughs> oh, that is so cute. I, I think she would go in it, though. I think she would. I think she would. Yeah, it looks nice and warm. Oh, and there's one for socks as well. They're so cute. <laughs> Little kitty beds. The time has come time for World of Disney. Fun. The big one. Wow. Luke's really getting into his coffee right now. <laughs> Disney coffee signature. Pumpkin spice. Oh, pumpkin spice. And blonde roast. I don't know what that is, but yeah. I'm really loving the up beers. Even with the grape soda on top. The chosen one. Oh, it's only kids. No, I'm not going to get away. No, it's not going to happen this time. Sometimes I can fit into a kid's extra large, but 
Disney, you need to do this in an adult size. Discover the magic. Very nice mug. It's one of the four parks mugs, isn't it? Yeah, we'll get that. We're gonna get this. That was our first look at the new completed World of Disney store, because last time there were still some segments shut. Yeah. What we will say is it's really well zoned. So like the different yeah. colours, different areas. Lovely. It's all grouped together really well. So you, you don't have to go from one side to the other to find something similar. No. It's a really nice store and there's a lot of nice stuff. We didn't actually buy anything in the end. Um, it was a good experience. And again, we're here early, so it's a really comfortable experience. <laughs> yes, yeah, so Rich wants to go to the Trendy store over near Westside. Yes. And then we're going to get lunch. So Wolfgang Puck has opened across the way from Chicken Guy. Looks nice and fresh and new. Chicken Guy opens at 11. Rich is going to be there at 11. At 11, yep. <laughs> I want to beat those crowds. <laughs> but I can probably just do a little bit of videoing of the amazing sauces that they have here. So they've got our favourite sauce, which is the bourbon brown sugar. Um, and I think I had the sweet and sour last time as well. But they do like chicken tenders, sandwiches, kids menu as well. It's really good. So we're gonna have a look in the Dizzy style store. Take out. Meet me at the People Mover phone case. <laughs> I love that. Twenty nine. So we're at Blaze Pizza, first stop of the day for lunch. Time for lunch. Time for lunch. Really good. I love that they do the half pizza box. I just wanted half pizza, um, and it's perfect like snack. And then we're going to go to Chicken Guy now because you like cold pizza, don't you? I love cold. Pizza. You like cold and hot pizza. So perfect combination. And it was super hot. I burnt my tongue. <laughs> so yeah, they're really fresh there. So we are at the Chicken Guy for stop number two after a successful Blaze Pizza visit. Let's get the chicken on. Sweet tea. So you get your drink, you put your buzzer there. And it's a table finder. So, so you get two distinct sauces with the uh, tenders, and then you can add extra sauces on for 50 cents. Oh, that's so. Yeah, so in total it was $19.30. So you've got five tenders, oh. fries, and all our sauces. <laughs> so lovely lunch done, two different places but we're all done. We're all done, yep. And we're just heading over to Boathouse now to meet um, Gemma and Steve from Spoonful of Sugar. So have a nice chilled drink. Yeah, we're just on Instagram, they're in the same place, so... Um, good old Instagram. <laughs> yeah, it works out really well. <laughs> So um, it's beautiful, absolutely now. lovely now, the sun's come out. Um, You've been wanting to get some clear blue sky pictures all day, haven't you? Yes, I could just magic myself into Epcot now. <laughs> yeah, we need to be in Epcot to get those cool pictures. And a lovely boathouse. Oh, an absolute place. One of our favourite places to eat. We're not eating here today, oh, but I'm just still happy to be here. Yeah! Love how beautiful this place is. So we are chilling here with Gemma 
and Steve. Hello. 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 If you haven't checked them out, check them out. Yeah. But we are currently sat on the dockside bar at the boat house. And every time a boat goes by, we get a little wave <laughs> and we're kind of floating along. So it's a bit stable at the moment. I'm not feeling seasick. You're feeling alright, aren't feeling you? I'm feeling alright, which I'm really surprised about. Yeah. It's, it's got a little bit of a rock, but. And we've just realised that we're all dining pretty much at the same time tonight at California, California Grill. So we may well see you guys later. <laughs> we just met up with um, Steve and Gemma from Spoonful of Sugar. Had a nice drink out there. Lovely drink, yeah. Lovely setting, lovely weather. Yeah, we just went to pay and the lovely server, Cindy, just let us get off. So she thank you, Cindy. She said Happy New Year. So yeah. thank you very much. Look at that blue water. It's so inviting. That water is so nice, isn't it? So, coming out at 1.15 and the Lime Garage is full. Yeah, it's busy. It's been a really nice time in Disney Springs, really chilled. It was really nice um, having a drink on the dockside bar, wasn't it? Yeah, really nice. Really yeah. nice breeze. The temperature is lovely. It's 75 degrees. The sun is coming out. If you're, really, if you're looking for somewhere in Disney Springs, just to ha even if just to have a drink, that dockside bar at Boathouse is really lovely. Really lovely. And the staff are really nice as yep. well. So, really good. Now, we're heading back to the villa now. We're going to have a sleep. We'll have a bit of time in the pool, a sleep, and then we're going to head back to Contemporary later. Excited! Uh, Let's go girls. back to the villa. We'll be going forward right now. We're going left, which can only mean one thing. Dunkin' Donuts! Dunkin' Donuts. Dunkin' Donuts. Colata. Before I'm too invested, I should probably ask you. Ask you all my questions. Get to know you better. Why can you be trusted? Will you take me for granted? the cool artists. There's Rich enjoying the sun. I'm so chilled out. The pool yeah. is lovely. It feels cool now but because the air temperature is high. Yeah. So the pool's cool. It's so nice being able to come back and just chill out for a bit. And yeah. We're have a lovely evening tonight aren't we? Yeah we're going to uh, California, California Grill. Grill. So let's swim. Let's get the ball. Da, da, da. It even says Mickey Mouse on it. <laughs> and it's got Mickey and let's check out. I'll do it one handed. Oh, it's quite hard to do one handed. This is what life's all about playing ball with Disney. For years, we've always, we used to always buy a Publix dollar ball, but. Oh, I might have to put the camera down. <laughs> It's not working very well, is it? Are you relaxed? So relaxed, yeah. Look at that sky. Whoa. 